Hey guys, welcome back. Today I thought I'd do a video um, answering a really popular question that a lot of people are asking. So, should you jailbreak your iPhone on iOS 8? So, a lot of people, as I said, a lot of people ask this and a lot of people don't really know much about what jailbreaking is. And um, a lot of people are also scared of jailbreaking because uh, the word break in jailbreak sounds um, as though it's something dangerous and um, but yeah so I'm just gonna give you the top six reasons why you should jailbreak and uh, I will explain why there aren't really any risks so reason number one you can theme pretty much anything so icons are probably the main thing people do theme as you can see I do have a custom theme on at the moment and there are thousands of these themes that you can download from Cydia and you can very easily make your own. But not only can you theme icons, you can theme in apps such as the Settings app here. I have a really cool blue theme going on. And you can theme um, other UI elements such as Control Center, which I will show you using an app such as Springtimize. You go into uh, Control Center, enable a custom color, and it actually lets you pick whatever color you want here to set as a theme. So if I use this color, I believe you might need a respring, nope, but as you can see there, I do now have a blue themed control center. So theming is definitely one of the main things that people go for jailbreaking for. Um, but yeah, that's only the start really. So reason number two is the adding of functionality by using tweaks and uh, like other kind of modifications. So there are so many things that you can modify and add new features to the system that just make iOS so much more enjoyable. So, for example, something as simple as adding a couple more icons on the dock. I have six icons on my dock. Normally you're limited to only four, but with a simple tweak, you can change the number of icons. You can also add um, other functionality rather than slightly changing something, such as a tweak that I'm actually making, where you can Add a whole other window that pops up and you can access your apps from in from within any other app and even open a web browser while you're uh, within another app so there's so many um, cool um, additions that you can like put onto your iPhone so that's probably the coolest part about jailbreaking being able to add all these different features that people don't even imagine so uh, point three as I said before very low risk people assume that there's risk but there's really not so if you think that your phone's going to break just from jailbreaking that's not going to happen if anything does go wrong you could always restore with itunes and just uh, start again so it's not going to break your phone and second people worry about the warranty of their phone well jailbreaking technically does void your warranty but if you un jailbreak your device and then take it back into an Apple store, they're not going to have any trace of the jailbreak on that device. So basically, it doesn't void your warranty as long as you know how to un jailbreak. So that's definitely um, a positive. Um, and reason number four you can download any file from Safari. So this includes like music, and uh, you can use these to set as your ringtone. And you can even manage all these files just by using um, an application I'll show you in a minute. But this really does make your phone more like a computer. So you won't really need to connect your phone to a computer if you want to download ringtones. And uh, yeah, you really can do it all from your device. And uh, so point number five is the full root access. So as I said before, iFile, this app here, allows you to browse the whole file system and you can have unrestricted access, modify any files and um, do quite a lot of cool things in here. So if you know what you're doing with iOS then this is probably an app that you're going to want to get. And finally, reason number six, probably the best reason at the moment is because you still can. Now jailbreaking is not going to be around forever so Apple will get to the point when they've patched all the exploits and uh, jailbreaks just it aren't possible anymore so you sh really should do it in these couple years we probably have left um, 
but yeah so because once in a few years we'll all just be stuck with unjailbroken phones again and that will not be as fun and definitely not as cool as having the jailbroken ones so yeah i hope these six reasons uh persuaded you to jailbreak or gave you some new ideas about it but um yeah so thanks for watching guys please subscribe for more videos and i'll see you in the next video